So this article comes out today by Sophia Narwitz. She has some inside sources that are confirming what a lot of people say they already know, which is games journalists, at least in the West, form this, what they call this cabal of the polygons, the Kotakus. They gatekeep to keep out anyone who is conservative or centrist. And they also start doing that to game developers as well. I'm not coming at it from a place where I can easily hate these people because ultimately I am a lefty. I am liberal. I am pro LGBT. I am uh, pro sanctuary cities. I'm voting for Bernie. I'd like to vote for Warren if she makes it. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm supposed to be one of these people. These are supposed to be my people. And I can't stand them. I can't stand them. Because they come off to me as so smug and self-righteous and so not liberal that they push me away from them that are supposedly champions of the same things that I believe in. You guys are supposed to be my people. You're supposed to be my tribe. We're supposed to be the ones that are for freedom and equality and anti-racism and let everybody, you know, um, have a shot and everybody is treated with fairness. And instead they've become a bunch of fucking elitist snob assholes. This guy, Justin Schreier, um, comes on and he says, he's a Kotaku guy. He says, this is conspiracy theory nonsense is what he says. He's one of the guys that he's, that's being accused of being part of this cabal. And somebody says, I would like to see games media showing diversity in terms of gender, sexuality, and ideas. I'm interested to hear how these companies are promoting ideological diversity. Is there anything showing this? The guy who asked this, which is a great question, because how many articles does Kotaku write about diversity in games? Where are the black people? Where are the women at? Where are the gays at? But the minute you ask Jason Schreier, hey, talk to me if, if, if these are conspiracy theories that you guys are pretty much a far left cabal that don't let any other kind of thoughts come into your little clubhouse. Talk to me about what your industry is doing to bring in different ideas. Guess what? The guy gets blocked. Now, I'm not saying Schreier is guilty of anything. I'm not saying this is admission by blocking. Schreier just may not have the patience. Schreier may look at this guy and say, I see the writing on the wall with this guy. This isn't going to lead anywhere productive. I don't know why I blocked him. But it's a pretty innocent question, especially given that Kotaku continuously writes articles about where's the diversity in video game studios? Where's the diversity in video game publishing? Where's the diversity in characters in video games? The minute somebody has the gall, this guy Dustin J has the gall to say, hey, where's the diversity in your workforce? video game journalist, the guy gets blocked. That's, that's not a good look. Little Jason, Jason S. It's not a good look at all. 